Pittsfield is located as far from Boston as, as you can possibly be. Berkshires is a thriving area. Summer season uh, brings a few more tourists than we would like, but that's actually what keeps us keeps us going and alive out here. I've lived here in Pittsfield all of my life. Uh, thought briefly a few years ago about uh, moving away, but I looked around me and I saw some things that a lot of other people were seeing, and that was that it really looked like Pittsfield was taking a turn upward and making a comeback. This is North Street. It's uh, the main street in Pittsfield. There's a lot of things here. Um, Albany Berkshire Ballet. There's a lot of business banking. And here we are at the Pittsfield Brew Works, uh, a restaurant, and they brew their own beer here. It is wonderful, and why don't you come on in? I used to work here back in the late 80s. The establishment has changed uh, hands from time to time, but now with great food and great homebrewed beer, it's a great place to come and see friends. This was the first place in the country that merino wool was actually manufactured. Um, and so the city of Pittsfield came up with this idea for what they called sheeptacular. And what they had were large renderings of sheep decorated by local artists all up and down North Street. It brought a lot of people into town, including us, and that's one of the reasons why we moved here from Philadelphia. We have 10 taps here at Pittsfield Brew Works. We've got good American pub fare. And we also have little pieces of artwork like this strewn through Pittsfield to indicate that there is a burgeoning art scene. There's some cafes, there's a few bars on North Street here. Uh, there's a juvenile courthouse. Um, yeah, you want that. <laughs> Cut. <laughs> We're in the middle of a construction site right now. We're looking to open the bar lounge of part of our business the end of April. A few weeks after that, we're going to open up our 125-seat a la carte restaurant. Soon to be a restaurant called Spice. Pittsfield was a GE town. GE pulled out of Pittsfield back in the late 80s, um, and it somewhat killed the town. The goal is to bring people back to the downtown, and we're starting to see that happen. Pittsfield was the birthplace of baseball in 1791. There was a bylaw banning it from being played too close to the courthouse because it was making too much noise. There were so many people wanting to be part of this game. And just down the street a little ways from here is Wakona Park. It's a beautiful little slice of baseball history. People look at Pittsfield as the next big thing. They're skiing here in Pittsfield, and there's also places like here at the Sky Dome where you can work on your golf game in your free time. See, that's terrible. <laughs> I hit the ground before I hit the ball.